With Ian Gillen celebrating his 71st birthday, I thought I'd revisit one of the albums that I really, really like from Ian, and that is Clear Air Turbulence, first issued in 1977 on the Island Records label. The album came in a luxurious gatefold sleeve with the pictures of the band members. Um, first album really to feature Colin Towns, who went on to be a very, very successful soundtrack composer. Ray Fennick on guitar, um, Mark Nusif on the drums, and uh, Gustafsson on bass. He was, sadly is no longer with us. Um, so fantastic gatefold sleeve and great sci-fi cover. I always thought that was very, very cool. Um, and it's a very, very good album. So, um, when did they play with this? This is about, I think, 1977, 78. Um, I saw them at Birmingham Odeon. I might have seen them at Barbarella's in Birmingham as well. And actually got all their autographs. And I'm going to show you the programme now. This is the Ian Gillan Band programme from 1977. the advert for the album on the inside sleeve and again the members of the band. A bit about Ian Gillen, focusing on his time in Deep Purple and being the singer for Jesus Christ Superstar. Colin Towns, advert for Melody Maker, again same gatefold pictures of the band from the album. John Gustafsson on the bass. Ray Fenwick and the autographs, which I remember going behind stage to get. Cheers, Ian Gillen. Well, Lucif, he's only 23 when he's in his band. And the support act was Straps, also on the Harvest label. I can't remember, well, Mark, the, there's a Gillen connection here, um, as you've got um, Underwood um, on the drums, who obviously later Nick Underwood went to join the Gillen band itself. And on the back cover, you have an advert for a make of jeans that is no longer with us, Brutus Gold. So that's the programme for Clear Air Turbulence from Ian Gillen. If you're looking to buy this album now, and you like, don't mind buying CDs, which I certainly don't, the one to go for is this, which is the double pack remastered version, which also has Scarabus on it. And this comes with a nice little informative booklet with all the lyrics for both albums and the artwork and a little essay from Ian himself so that is Clear Air Turbulence in celebration of Ian's birthday